We're going to go through some of the most popular bugs in the bed that are not bed bugs. Make sure to stay until the end because some of these may surprise you. All of these bugs in the bed are real bugs that were found by some of our clients at one time or another. Are you having trouble sleeping because of creepy crawly critters in your bed? Just because you see them in your bed, you might assume they're bed bugs. But did you know that there are other insects that can invade your sleep space? Meet the carpet beetle. The larvae of these bugs are often mistaken for bed bug shed skins. We often help people ID these shed skins over texted photos. So if you find something that has you concerned, capture a good, clear, zoomed in image and send it to us. We'll have links in the description for our contact info. Carpet beetle larvae have hairs on their body that can cause skin irritation, which can sometimes resemble bed bug like reactions. However, unlike bed bugs, carpet beetles do not feed on human blood. And then there's the dreaded body lice, small parasites that live within your clothing and bedding and feed on human blood. They can cause intense itching and require a lot of showers and high heat drying to eradicate. Another common culprit is the dust mite. These microscopic creatures thrive in warm human environments like your bedding and feed on dead skin cells. While they don't bite or sting, they can trigger aller allergies and asthma symptoms. The first step in getting rid of dust mites is to vacuum. It's important to vacuum all cushioned surfaces like headboards and couches on a regular basis. Fleas are also known to infest beds, especially if you have pets that bring them indoors. Typically fleas live on the animal, but their eggs, larvae, and pupae will be in your carpeting, upholstered furniture, and bedding. These blood-sucking parasites can cause itchy bites and transmit diseases like typhus. You'll recognize a flea by its laterally compressed body that's optimized for crawling through fur. Finally, there's the book louse. Despite their name, these insects don't actually feed on books, but instead prefer damp environments like bathrooms and basements. Sometimes you'll find them around your bed if you're up against a wall that has a moisture issue. In the description, we'll link to some good dehumidifiers. Book lice don't bite or spread diseases, but can be quite upsetting if you see them in your bed. So how do you tell these bugs apart from bed bugs? One way is to look at their physical characteristics. Bed bugs are reddish brown with flatter bodies, while all the other bugs on the list have very different features. Another way is to pay attention to where you find them. While bed bugs tend to hide in cracks and crevices near the sleeping area, the other bugs will not. Also, bed bugs leave behind black ink-like droppings. Other insects like fleas may be found on your pet's bedding or in other areas of the home. If you're dealing with any of these pests, it's important to take action right away. This includes washing all bedding in hot water, vacuuming regularly, sealing up any cracks or gaps in the home, and contacting a pest control professional if necessary. We would really appreciate it if you could like and subscribe to our channel.